But finding me proved no simple task. For having fallen afoul of Novigrad's underworld bosses, I'd disappeared. Yet Geralt soon discovered my whereabouts, a cell in the dungeon of the Temple Guard. With the help of our friends, Geralt managed to free me. Good thing, too. For indeed, I knew what had happened to Ciri. Sadly, she was no longer in Novigrad. Pursued by bandits and cornered by the Temple Guard, she had disappeared in a flash of light and a gust of heat. Where to? This I did not know. Sorry, mate. Gotta fill your horn elsewhere. This establishment's part of Skellige today. Seems to me we're still in Novigrad. And in Novigrad, Novigrad rules apply. Rules you happen to be breaking. Just how's that? You're not allowed to drink in peace. Have a bit of fun. Leg it, man, before you taste the wrath of a Skellige. Collect your friends and go. On your best behavior now. Hey! Gents! Time to go! This blade's not worth shite if a weak arm's swinging it, eh? I. Damn. My noggins. Damn the black one! Thanks so much! We'd not have managed on our own. We're not rich, but I hope this is enough. Keep it. He did more than I do. Thank you. He spoke like you restore my faith in humankind. Either that or friend. Cost you double in the rain. <laughs> Kristen, captain of the Atropos. So you want to know if I'm Atropos, captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me. We're due to sail for our own Skellig. Carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Stranger. Captain Wolf 
Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rocking bearable. So, ready to set sail? Let's go. Ah, uh, first, we must drink to the wind, to good fortune, and to the strength of my Atropos. <sighs> Anchors away! Back off, or I'll kill you. <laughs> I'm not a fear to die. Rob every corpse that washes up on shore. Taken from a corpse ain't theft. I'm a man of the isles. I don't reap. I don't sow. The waves bring me my harvest. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack. Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ard Skellig. There's a wetcha Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you think she was a beached orca? Fact is, even those who see her for a wench would gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. Yennefer's not all bad, once you get to know her. <laughs> Take your word for it. Know the way to Kertrolda? Expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port side today. Your sorceress ought to be there, too. Thanks. So long.
collect some silver earrings from the continent, perchance? Greetings. Looking to buy? Show me your way. So long. This here's a calm village. No, we not come closer, stranger. Who knows? That's it, Roach. Send us away with I time somebody I'm carrying. You would sacrifice me best mare. What's an honor? You were good and true here. Our valiant king! Red is our loss. You're not the dead must. That's very something that you're the eyes. Greetings. I'm Geralt. The Witcher known as the White Wolf, I know. They tell stories about you every day round here. Looking for an open seat at the table? I'll be fine. Just wanted to talk. What smells so delicious? Gotta say, I like the place. I should hope so. Found it a rune when I came here from Undvik. Gulls shitting into the tankards through the gaps in the thatch. I bought the hut. Rolled up my sleeves and made a proper alehouse out of it. Why do you call it the new port? Continuity. Owned the old port on Undvik. Few of my former customers come here evenings to reminisce about the old times. Actually kinda in the mood for cards. Care for a round of Gwent? I'm always in the mood for Gwent.
over there, Witcher. You looking for work by any chance? Why can't I play today, Dad? We got to go to the pool to wait for the man in the brown. It's not fit to play at. Only the king of Skellige and the king's passing. Our time amongst the living is but the wink of an eye. Not do this, child. I know, but I want to. This madness. Such a young lass. Erna should be the one going. They shared a bed long Silence. Or... This is her decision. You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirsech has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day. You knew Bran? Yes. He was well respected. Unlike his wife. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The gates? of care trolls stand open to all who hail Bran of Clan Twirsach, dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Come to the wake with me. Gladly. Feasts in Skellige. So predictable. Slobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yeah, nothing like the banquets mages attend. Remember the one on Thanet? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet.
reading my mind again? Mm. What's more, I like what I see. Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this Baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Siri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen. Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Ciri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion, with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Ciri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Syria was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Ciri was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors, not even for old time's sake. So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. White Wolf! Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake, and I'll not accept any excuses. I've an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Krak, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose something. In the meantime, I've something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall. Would you like to buy something from the stash? 
Maybe. Let me see what you got. Let's play cards. Gwent wouldn't be bad. those swords. Bran was a great ruler. He needs a worthy successor. You speak as though you have someone in mind. 
Skellige's troubles very much derive from it not being a hereditary monarchy. Any upstart can be king and destroy his predecessor's legacy. The King of the Isles is a more symbolic position. That should change as well. A strong leader who wields true power. That is what the times require. I'm Geralt, a witcher. Berna, Queen of Skellige. I'm glad we've met, but you must forgive me. Judy calls. I can see you chose your own outfit. You know, of course, that together we look about as good as lace frills on a battle axe. Everyone's got their style. We should mingle before they all get drunk. There'll be no talking to anyone then. Good thinking. I don't know what Krach wants, but when we meet with him, we should have clear minds. I'm not gonna drink. Why dull my senses when I'm in such pleasant company? Do you plan to compliment me all evening? I plan to tell you what I think. Adventure seeker. Geralt, do you think I donned an evening dress to show off for the seals? Just want to get some air. Very well. Once you've aired out thoroughly, find me by the entrance to the feast hall. Melt this blade and forge it again. A sword for cutting, not looking pretty. Interested in the... What are you peddling? Tell me a story about one of your weapons. See this sword? You know by its crafter's mark that it was forged in the Isles. Belonged to Lars. It would have been the same age as I. What happened to him? His wife went missing during a nasty storm. It was said the goddess smiled fondly on her. So Lars refused to believe she was truly dead. He ran out on the rocks and begged Freya to give his wife back. Left his sword behind to show the gods humility. And never returned for it. Selling that same sword now? We could have tossed it in the sea. But Fish got no use for blades. He had no family. So I'm selling it. To the right man. Got a diagram. Like you to craft... Wouldn't mind a few rounds of Gwent.
Ah, watch it. Greetings, White Wolf. Oh, uh, yeah? I'll gladly see from... Take your time. Wouldn't mind a look at your... What do you think? Who will be the next king of the Isles? Yalmar, clear as day. Lad's brave and generous. And from Croc's own line. No better claimant. Looking for someone who can make me a master quality breastplate. Never known a master who wasn't a dwarf. Fergus, perhaps? Say he's holed up somewhere in Velen. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards.
So you're back. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. So long. Over there, Witcher. You looking for work by any chance? No such thing as bad shit. Going to be puzzles. That's why you. Yeah. Yeah. What's that supposed to mean? Hey, over some of the dogs that bit ye. This has got to be Yen's room. She always did like space. To luxury. Freeze, the poison source. Still turns to it for inspiration. Her megascope? She never goes anywhere without it. As Philippa Eilhart said, megascopes and toothbrushes, deeply personal possessions. Scent of lilac and gooseberries, even with the lid on. Taste hasn't changed. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As usual, black and white. Hmm, the stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. Friends we show heart, foes we show wonder if he's strong as he looks. Greetings. Smooth seas the You a tailor? I am. Glad they look at what wise man. Take it you're good with scissors. Give me a haircut. In something I usually do. So long. You're pale. You drink last night too? Gonna be puddles. Raining again. Gonna be puddles.
Got me eye on you. Last night was <sighs> who's this? You rock chains. Sir. Greetings, Arnvald. My companion is Geralt of Rivia. I am honored. Nice to meet you, too. Quite a few guests. They come to bid their king farewell. They come to see the claimants to the crown. We wanted to talk to Croc on Crate. The Jarl will join us shortly. He's assigned you a place of honor at the table just beside his daughter, Ceres. Follow me, please. Seated us here. I asked them to. Wanted to meet the notorious Witcher Geralt. We've met. Don't remember? That was ages ago. Yalmer and I were children when you last visited Orda. But you should meet your face mates. Allow me the dubious honor. That's Halbjorn, son of Holger Blackhand, Blue Boy Lucas, Madman Lucas's firstborn, and choking down a stockfish over there is Altric on Hindar. Forgive me, I remember our meeting all those years ago, but I don't recall your name. Ceres on Crate, Crack her da, and her big brother Yalmer call a Sparrowhawk. A Yal's daughter she is. Fat lot of good it doesn't. Ceres is jealous, for the one among us who performs the greatest feat will be crowned king. <laughs> we all know the feats are a sideshow. Our fathers will choose who will wear the crown. What do you think they spoke to Crack about? You talk like that because you're short of strength and skill. But remember when Hjalmar challenged us all to a race up the mount? You didn't stand with us then. As he buried his axe in that stump at the top to mark his victory, you were warming your chicken bones by the fire. Had my reasons for not participating, but I would have won then, as I'd win now. Hmm, now that you mention him, I just noticed Hjalmar's not here. My brother walks his own paths. But about the race, why don't we repeat it? I'm willing to challenge any of you, Witcher included. If I beat him to the top, venture to say that'll be a feat, eh? So you're in. If the Witcher's in. Geralt? <laughs> Honored to be asked, but maybe some other time. Yeah, shame. Enough of the nather and let's drink. <laughs> to Ceres. Pass the mead and a tankard for the man. To Bran. Me want for nothing in the world beyond. To my beautiful companion. You've been great company. Sadly, it's time we moved on. Really? Indeed. We must talk, but not here. You shall learn all beyond that door.
to a cold, distant shore, I must cross the wide, somber sea. I will say, I must leave you behind. Sweet. You might think me unkind. Cross the wide, somber sea, I will say. <laughs> Feasts of Kerr Trold are legendary. On a cold Axe tossing, tamed bears. Yeah, I'll tell the shoulders. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. Geralt, Jarl Donar and Hinda, and Jarl Madman Lugos. Calling Lugos a madman's an insult to madmen. He's a common goat fucker. Call me a goat fucker one more time, and I'll chop off your head, stick it on a pike, and piss down your neck hole. Enough! Time to settle this. Here and now. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Giving me a true freight right now. Shat my best trousers. Put that away before you cut yourself, you cunt. Thought Skelligers called a truce for feasts. I know the hallowed customs. But Lugos ought to know that I'll not let him raid my Hindus Fial bear. You don't scare anyone, Donor. I'll be boy soon to plough your priestesses, drink from your tankard, and shit on your table. Be sure to leave a candle lit for me. Emperor would be very pleased to hear you quarrel. His Imperial Majesty is more than welcome to visit. Let him sail over here. We ain't afraid of the Black Ones. Raiding coastal villages is one thing. Total war with the Empire is another. Awfully melty, this one. Go stir your cauldron and pierce some boils, witch. Don't talk when you haven't got a fucking clue. Know what, Lugos? Just realized I don't give a damn about your hallowed rules of hospitality. Finally, some toy version. And here I was ready to puke from all the boredom. Come on, freak. Show us what you're made of. <laughs> Move the benches. There's to be some gob slapping. Make him choke in his teeth already! 